All right, we are doing a video now on the catching process. Um, job's kind of already got started here, but um, as you get started, as you can see, you pull up on Printavo, um, print proof, that way as they're coming off the press and coming out of the dryer, uh, be able to kind of compare the, the print compared to what's actually being printed. So as you can see there, um, we have this pulled up here. Um, and as they are printed as well, you can kind of just tell, just to make sure everything matches what you see there so um I'll have regina kind of just tell you what she does from this point as they're kind of coming off here so Sorry. do you want me to start from the beginning of what i do yep okay first thing i do is when i get to order i check and see if there's a back a front sleeve whatever and then i pull up the print and match as they're doing the test run and then I start once he starts running then I lay him out and for me I lay him out in order of the size yep it works better for me that way yep it should be that way um, you have the paperwork to compare to yep. um, as you can see here we have our paperwork here um, you have pink there so we know that it's an order form so as she when she gets done with this order she'll fold them individually um, for everything as well so um, this order has been laid out as you can see with the multiple colors of it been laid out um, so right now so she lays it out by each item and by each uh, you know same with color as well so let's um, go with your next kind of your next you do now next. the sh shirts are coming down the dryer so once they get down to me then I can lay them out as they're coming out I check it every shirt to make sure the print's right make sure there's no mistakes um, if there's um, if it's a non-order form how she has it here she'll uh, box them in groups of 12 how they are sent to us so we do the same thing um, if it's something that we don't need to do order forms wise um, go ahead show us how you would do one as if it was um, it going through the box of 12. Okay. Hold them in half and then once the whole order is done then you go get, look at your order number, go get your box, put a bag in it, and sometimes it's Pickup Sioux City, sometimes it's Speedy or uh, UPS. So you always have to check your order to see where your box is going. Um, so it has, she has some coming here. She do one just to show like if it's an order form. So since okay. this, like if this is like an order form, we fold them individually just because we're bagging uh, for each individual order. So that way it's easier for the people that are pulling the orders down at the end. Um, so that's how it's pretty much ready to go. And you have them by each size that way. So um, for the time being, how she has them laid out here um, is fine. That way she can do a double check of the total quantities as it's coming down. Um, to make sure she has the correct amount of smalls, medium, larges, and etc. So, yeah. um, so once the order is complete, we move it down to uh, where it needs to go next. Like she said, order forms is pink, so it'll get moved down to the order form area. Um, well, this gets the back first, so, and then it'll get moved. Uh, yep. Yeah, you know, so another print will need to be yep. done. So uh, mm -hmm. before it gets moved. So other than that um, that's it for the process for catching um, we'll show you how to do the boxing and everything as well once it's complete um, with a later video